We're on Ahalot, Perak Aleph, Mishnah, Zion. So we learned in our last Mishnah that a person is mitame once he's dead, when they say enough show. But it's not just a human being, not just a whole body. It's a part of a body. We're going to learn very, very tiny parts of a body, even a kazayit. Or even, the Mishnah says, an aver, a limb. We're going to learn in the next Mishnah how many limbs there are. Avarim, limbs, elem shior. There is no measurement. There's no minimum amount. Afilu pachot mi kazayit min hameit. Even if it's less than a kezayit mina mate, mina, mina mate is to metame bekezayit, unless it's an avar, an entire limb. Okay, what's an entire limb? You can see, like even a tiny bone. You know, like we're going to learn, there are tons of bones in the body, so it has to be. What's an avar? What is a limb? Tzarech she'ayabahem basar v'gidim v'asamot. It has to have flesh, sinews, and bones. Ubekach nechshav avar, and that's what's considered a limb. Okay, Umayri is talking about bein avar shenidlash mina chai. May never should mean I made, whether it's from the living or even from a dead body. So there's no minimum measurement, even less than a kazai mean I made. Upachot mean kazayit mean hanavela, or from a kazai from the nevela, from an animal. Okay, if it's an entire avar, it's, it's too much avar, too much nevela. Upachot mi ke adasha mean asheretz. And that's the amount asheretz, right? The shratzim, they're creepy crawly things, certain, they're not bugs, certain, certain, certain animals that are considered a din of sheretz. And it has to be ke adasha. Adasha is a is a is a is a lentil. So even tiny amount, metamin to matan, they're still metame as long as they're an entire avar, an entire limb. And our next bishop we're gonna learn about how Chazal perceived what their perception was of how many limbs there are in the body. Short Mishnah. So we'll stop here, dedicate our learning. It's a memory of my father, Arab Simcha Ben Kalman. Make it a great day.